Last time on Game Grumps. I thought Hifumi was just the murderer. Yeah, that was like a fun twist. But there's a double twist. It's like a crazy straw. Celeste was always like, here I am, whoa, what's going on here? And she took the picture yeah, and- Oh yeah, let's try it. Praying to God it's right! <laughs> Ding dong, guilty. Yeah. And what was this dream of yours? To live in a European castle and to gather handsome men from all over the world to serve as my butler slash bodyguard. Damn. All right, I can get behind Yeah, that. yeah. <laughs> I guess I'll let Kyoko hold on to this. Oh, okay. The burning of the Versailles witch. Fwishy, fwishy. <laughs> Answer me. What did you do to my body? What? Is she a cyborg? Hey, I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. Uh, hello, everybody! It's Game Grumps time! <laughs> oh, we're back! We're- we're back with all your- your- your dangin' rumples fun that you wanted! Yeah. Hooray! So for all you people who we're, have been emailing me like, STICK WITH ONE GAME! We're doing- <laughs> <laughs> We're doing Don Gone Ron for today. Yeah, and also, just- just so everyone knows and can put your mind at ease, um... I mean, we, we, we do mix it up, but we're finishing this game. Oh, like, yeah, no question. Do, do not fear. Like, I lay awake at night wondering who's going to die next. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I was laying well, awake at night last night after playing Doom Eternal Ancient Gods Part 1 um, that uh, wondering, wondering to myself, I say, uh, why Kyoko has been disappearing all the time. Yeah, I'm curious. Uh, I, there's a lot of stuff that I wonder uh, about with this game, but I have a feeling that all will be revealed yeah. or it won't and they'll just die and you'll be like, well, I don't care anymore because they're dead. <laughs> <laughs> and then a second one will come out and then we'll be like, oh, well, the answers will be in this one. And then, <laughs> yeah. Meanwhile, it's like 15 all new people who die. <laughs> yeah. Six sequels later. I would, I would guess. I, who knows? Um, but okay. So we just finished the third trial. Yeah. Yes. Um, okay. and who's a, what's it was the, Killer. They work together. Who was it Celeste. that worked together? Celeste, Celeste and, Hifu and Hifumi. Yes, they work together. I guess, but Hifumi was already dead, so it was fine. Um, and I still didn't understand why he was dead, but not dead in that moment where he got up and said things. But none of that matters right now. The point is, <laughs> Kyoko has been disappearing a lot, and where has Kyoko been going? We're about to find out because Kyoko's about oh my to tell God. us. Okay. Uh, right after I told Kyoko I believe in her, she told me a story that was, well, almost unbelievable. <laughs> I just, <laughs> like the man door hand hook car door story. <laughs> I didn't believe that. I decided I had to confirm what she told me with my own tune eyes. Two eyes. My tune eyes. Wow. <laughs> you and the word I. It's just... <laughs> Something really, there's some blockage there. When I think of tune eyes, I think of like the Hanna Barbera sound effects. It's like. <laughs> <laughs> so I waited for nighttime to come. And when it time. did, I went to action. <laughs> All right, cool. Keep, keep is, is that your, um, is that your mouse cursor in the middle of the screen or is it mine? It is yours. Dang it. How do I move it? Just click. I did it. <laughs> Hell yeah. Success! <laughs> it's Kyoko. The, the boys' bathroom on the second floor doesn't have a surveillance camera or monitor in it. <gasps> That's a shame, because I really wanted to look at some wiener. <laughs> and in the storage closet there. <laughs> way in the back. Put, put, file that under things Kyoko would never say. <laughs> way yeah. in the back. Yeah. She said it was way in the back of the boys' bathroom storage closet, but could Kyoko really be right about this? All right. And also, what is she talking about? I'm going to the boys' storage closet. Dorito chip bodies. Only, if only. <laughs> Smoking in the boys' room! Wait, Wait, where's the storage closet? Uh, is it... what? There's a storage closet? Oh, I guess it's that back there. Yeah. Oh, oh yes. It's just a normal storage closet as far as I could tell. The secret Kyoko told me about could it really be hidden here? She's just been taking massive dumps into this bucket. <laughs> I can't take poopies in here! I'm <laughs> uh, uh, sorry. <laughs> she said it was- she said it was in the back- it was way in the back of the storage closet. You know, like way in the back of this <laughs> three by three storage closet. <laughs> I was gonna say. But I mean, seriously? Without thinking, I placed my hand on the back of the storage closet and suddenly, as if it were being yanked on, Whoa! Whoa. 
Shunk. At the same time as I heard that sound, I fell through the wall. I had no idea what was going on. I just knew I was falling through a wall. Look at this. Wow. You did a gashunk and then followed quickly by a ba bump. <laughs> I had fallen through the back of the storage closet with many onomatopoeias. Huh? Man, I've got an onomatopoeia, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, great one, Aaron. Too bad I just <laughs> fell out of the bathroom. It turned out the back wall was like a revolving door and I'd made my way to the other side. Just like Kyoko had said. Correct. Remember when she just said it? <laughs> In the boys' bathroom on the second floor, there's a storage closet. You gotta be kidding me. It was a story that was truly unbelievable. <laughs> and way in the back of that closet, there's a secret room. Now you can drop turds in peace. <laughs> so this is the secret room. But what's in here? Some kind of crumpled paper? Pipes? I guess that's all there is. I can shoot boobies. <laughs> pew, pew, ping, pew, 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 ping. <laughs> just, <laughs> just shooting boobies all over the Pew, pew, ping. It's just a normal ping. desk with no. And like, it cuts to people's heads as they like move around <laughs> looking at shit <laughs> as it bounces around the room. <laughs> wow, it moves like they do. It's just, it's just a normal desk with normal drawers. What about these books? There's a bunch of files, and what looks like volume after volume of yearbooks. They're all covered in dust. Looking at everything, one file at the edge of the bookshelf caught my eye. Hope's Peak Academy Student Registry? Oh, or, sweet. Now we're getting down to it. Or, for short, Passer. <laughs> passer. That's, this is the only thing in here not covered in dust. Has someone been looking at it recently? But who? Probably I Kyoko, right? Yeah. I mean, she, yeah. She's the one who was in this room. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I, I slipped the file into my hand, but before I had a chance to take a look at it, a slip of paper fell out of the file and I turned my attention to it. What's this? What does it say? I can't read! <laughs> you must not leave. That's kind of weird. I could understand if it said, like, I can't leave, but you must not leave. <sighs> anyway, I'm gonna go murder somebody. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> My head feels funny. This strange sensation. It's like, deja vu. Those words, you must not leave. I've seen them somewhere before. In this game? I, I don't, I don't remember. I can't. I don't, yeah, I don't. Maybe it's putting us in the shoes of Makoto. <laughs> I'm trying to rem- I, I, I don't remember anyone saying anything yeah, like that. Yeah, me neither. I can't quite remember. What do I know? What don't I know? I- I- uh, <laughs> oh. Holy uh -oh. crap, what? Uh -oh. oh, damn. Somebody oh shit, did we just us. die? Oh. <laughs> Through the rest of the game, you play as a ghost. Oh, just like phasmophobia. Yeah. I have to walk around the gym and <laughs> you guys are like, I wonder if Dan was watching over us, helping us, and I'm like somewhere else like trying to figure out like, oh, can I pick up this basketball? <laughs> it was really funny to watch. Oh, Dan, are you with us right now? And you're like, hmm. Where am I? <laughs> a, a strange sound rang out throughout my head. Felt like it was shaking my brain back and forth. And then... Darkness. I don't understand what's happening. I don't know what started it. It's all over. And with that, I opened my eyes. I didn't know how long it had been. Dead. Uh-oh. Oh, crap. <laughs> Ow. Apparently, something hit me and I lost consciousness. That's all I understood. Did you Nothing's the different figure... about the room. <laughs> <laughs> did, did you uh, notice that the masked figure had um, Monokuma's eye symbol on this in the center of his forehead. Oh, really? Like his little evil red eye. Oh, I didn't know that. I yeah, I think that. so. I was trying to. I was more looking at their clothes because I was. I was like, oh, is that a clue? Like, is it a cl outfit somebody else wears all the time? Right, of course. But it wasn't. Damn it's, it. It's kind of like Mondo's jacket, but not really. 
Hmm. The dull throbbing pain in my head proved that much at least. Oh no, the books are gone! An empty <laughs> bookshelf. Huh? Empty? Gone! <laughs> it's all gone! The yearbooks, the student registry, and even the note that had fallen on the floor. It's all gone? Remember what Kyoko told me? <laughs> <laughs> what does this mean? But my brain refused to do any more work. The insistent pain... In, insistent... Yeah, I guess it's insistent. The insistent yeah. pain in my head began to spread across the rest of my body. <laughs> it insists! For now, I should go back to my room. Get some rest. <laughs> I've had a long day of falling and getting hit on the head. <laughs> my body was heavy. Mom's spaghetti. <laughs> <With pain. laughs> <laughs> That's so dumb. <laughs> my, my, my body was heavy with pain. My mind heavy with thought. I dragged myself back toward my room. Hickory dickory dot. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> wow. Somehow I made it back to the first floor of the school. <clears throat> the farther I walked, the more I felt. Things are getting blurry. Can't see Mom's in front of me. Mom's <laughs> spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> Mom's brown curry. <laughs> Can't see in front of me. <laughs> I couldn't stop myself from collapsing right there. And after that... Mom's brown hair. <laughs> As if from vast distance I heard a sound. It was faint but undeniable. Somebody was ellipsing. Yeah, right? <laughs> that sound. It's coming from the gym! Now I'm in the gym. <laughs> As I desperately hauled my shaky frame toward the gym, the sound got stronger and stronger. Mom's Crack. badonger. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm done. No more of that joke. <laughs> Crack! Daga! Gagunk! Bagya! <laughs> what is there a fucking chicken farm in here? I. I <laughs> it's, like a it's like a Calvin and Hobbes strip. <laughs> What's going on? And who's Gagunk? It can't be nothing. Here in the gym? Guess I'll go to the gym. Yeah, seriously. Why is the UI green now? I don't know. I didn't make a sound as I opened the door to the gym. The sound- The door made the sound. <laughs> <laughs> I want it to be clear. The sounds coming from the inside, meanwhile, only intensified that much more. Kacha, Bakyu, Hagagya, Haya, Paching, Bakya, Dadadan, Sha 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 Sha. What are we summoning something? Whoa! 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 What the? F what in the world? Before me raged a battle beyond anything humanly possible. No, one side. No, one side's not human, that's for sure, but... Regardless, I couldn't stop staring. I forgot to move or even breathe. Why you? What do you think you're doing? Oh, man. Wait, who's he gonna, talking to? I think he's talking to Sakura. Oh, okay. I asked you a question. What's the meaning of this? Oh, yeah, Sakura's But won't he just kinda... explode? Oh, if, yeah. If she, if she hits him? Oh, man. Maybe she just got too mad. The deal? The what? The deal? Made a decision. Whoa. Will no longer retreat. No longer compromise. No longer regret. Hell yeah, dude. I've made my decision. <gasps> I'm going to resist you. Hell yeah! Oh shit! Hmm. Okay. But now she's gonna die. You do realize what will happen if you go through with this, right? You haven't forgotten, have you? Oh, um, yeah, actually, uh, I think I might have. <laughs> it's okay, I watch 90 Day Fiance, I watch people make mistakes all the time. <laughs> what am I looking at? What am I hearing? A hostage? Then could it be? The mastermind spy is... No, my favorite. 
Wow, really? S Sakura? Yeah, but she like is rebelling, so that's cool. She's the last person I would have suspected. Yeah, I guess that's why it was effective. Wow. Really dropping like flies now, aren't they? <laughs> All continued. right, there was the end. Yeah, there was the end of part three. Well, we're not done. <gasps> no. S Super Robo Justice. Oh, hooray. I'm gonna put it on my shelf. Yeah, it can remind me of the three friends that died yesterday. <laughs> Leon killed Sayaka, just in case you missed this. Yeah. Monokuma killed Junko. God, this is like the Gashly Crumb Tinies. Then Leon got- what? You know, you know that, um, A is for Annette, who fell off a bridge. You know, oh. th those, yeah, 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 or, that's not real, but, that's the gist. Mm-hmm. That's what they're that, called, the Gashly Crumb Tiny. Yeah, I remember that. I didn't know that was the name of it, though. Yeah, pretty catchy. It is pretty Then cool. Leon- Then Leon got executed! Congratulations <laughs> to him for being wow. promoted to an executive level. <laughs> Uh, then Makono, then Mondo killed Chihiro, and then, and then he got executed. <laughs> turned in, turned into dad butter. <laughs> Hifumi killed Taka, then Celeste killed Hifumi. It's a lot of fun happening. Then she yep. got executed. And it's We like, sure had some good times. <laughs> when's my turn? Oh, Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. <laughs> <laughs> and that brings us up to now. The next Hello, more ever, ever more sparsely populated <laughs> kitchen. Yeah, but Sakura's still alive. Yeah, she is. The next morning in the dining hall, the day after Celeste's case. So now there's only five of us here. <sighs> only a third of the number of people we started with, man. Loneliness has become commonplace. That's true. <laughs> um, do you want to talk about what happened last night? <laughs> Anything you want to tell us? <laughs> Still. Yeah. What did I see yesterday? It's not like I have one of the people I saw yesterday right in front of me and could ask. I don't yeah. understand. And why did I see it at a Dutch angle? <laughs> yeah. And why is the screen all warbly? Sakura <laughs> is the mastermind spy. Can and why is there that one Tetris piece missing from the wall? <laughs> I just want to complete it! Maybe then the wall will disappear and we can get out of here! <laughs> can that really be true? Makoto, are you okay? Uh, no, I'm fine! You know, I just... <laughs> we're not I gonna mention- I playing with your dolls again! <laughs> what the f- yes! <laughs> Good! <laughs> I can't bring it up in front of the others. If I did that, it would just confuse everyone that much more. Okay, in that case, let's eat till we pass out! Huh? <laughs> what do you mean in that case? Cause well, cuz look how scary everyone looks! It's gotta be cuz you're all fighting on empty stomachs, right? That's gotta be it, right? That's the only thing that would be upsetting you right now? <laughs> if you fill your belly, I'm sure you'll all cheer up, so let's eat! You're just hungry, that's all! You're just hungry! <laughs> it's just like beating your head on the wall like, Ah, you're just hungry! It's like, oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> let's let's fry up some fish and donuts and eat till we can't stand up. That's a great combination, right? Fish and donuts. Ew. <laughs> That's like deep impact style, meteor impact, extinction level event combination of foods. <laughs> what? Those are both breakfast type times top sellers. <laughs> Still, the till we can't stand up part is a problem. After we're done, we need to go explore. That's right. Since the class trial is over, new areas should have opened up. It's true. Plus, we still have alter ego. We don't have to give in to despair just yet. Um, cameras. Kyoko cameras? <laughs> She's right. We have to plan ahead to think about That's the That's a really good point. Like that, they're just- They made a point of like, we can only talk about alter ego in this room, and then suddenly it's just like, oh, wow, we have a computer that's got a thing on it. It's helping hack us the way out of here. <laughs> Yay! Yeah, yeah, think happy thoughts, not deathly thoughts. You know? Deathy. Like when we're gonna get out of here, right? Oh, hero. <laughs> Smell my finger of <laughs> despair. When this is all over, I think I want to get reborn for serious. Uh, I mean, reborn as someone serious. Dude, I, I, knowing the way this game goes, I think you'll get that chance. Mm-hmm. 
Keep forgetting to put this mustache on my finger. <laughs> hey, are you okay? That sounds like something someone who's about to die would say. Oh, crap. <laughs> I'm totally okay. I'm not gonna die. Why? Because there aren't gonna be any more murders. Oh, okay. I misunderstood <laughs> how, how he said that. Why? <laughs> Because there aren't going to be any more murders. I'm not going to die. Why? Because there aren't going to be any more murders. <laughs> um. Sorry, I, I like to answer my own rhetorical questions. <laughs> huh? What makes you so sure? According to the spirits. I predicted it last night, since it revealed itself to me from the ether. The ether. The ether? So there's no doubt about it. However. How accurate is your fortune telling anyway? <laughs> How about that? I can usually hit 20 or 30 percent on a good day! <laughs> I love him. <laughs> that seems really low! Well, like oh, yeah, it's not like it's ESP or whatever. Extra super pain. <laughs> of course, I'm not- I'm only gonna get it right sometimes. Can I just say, as an aside, um, I'm not really a college football fan, but the quarterback for, uh, the Indiana Hoosiers, his last name is Penix. P-E-N-I-X. <laughs> And I'm like, dude, <coughs> I would buy that jersey in a fucking heartbeat. <laughs> that is fantastic. Yeah, I'm number 69, Phoenix. <laughs> <laughs> so awesome. All right. Sorry, please continue. So I, I told you my fortune telling isn't like some occult thing. So fortune telling isn't a cult? You got it all wrong. Of course not. Clairvoyance is clairvoyance. Don't put it in the same category as cattle mutilation. What? Ca what are you talking about, dude? He's referring to the urban legend where aliens abduct cows and dissect them as part of their research. Actually. No! You're calling <laughs> it an urban legend? As a matter of fact, it's true. As a matter of fact, it's happened to me. I was a cow! It all happened one day where I went to go get a hamburger. It was a place I'd never been before. They claimed their patties were 100% all beef. Damn. Now this is- now this is where the game gets deep. Yeah. So I got a burger to go and headed home. I have a strong feeling this story is not gonna go anywhere. And before long, the sky was filled with a mysterious blinding light. <laughs> Some crazy beam came out of nowhere and locked onto my hamburger. And as soon as the beam touched it, the burger started floating in midair. And then... Still floating there, the entire burger started coming apart. Oh, he's saying it, sorry. Alright, dude. <laughs> And 30% beef would be my guess. Yeah, it's got just about oh, the so amount of beef that you're right about clairvoyancy. Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> you can't trick me. So I stormed back into the burger place and got up in the manager's grill. Not his literal grill, his figurative grill. <laughs> and they totally admitted it. It wasn't 100% beef. They totally mixed in ground pork with it. How about that? Now do you see? That is cattle mutilation. I kind of got lost halfway through. Also, I like pork, so I wouldn't mind. Where's this burger place? I'm so sad that Hero is probably going to die because he's one of my favorite characters in any game. <laughs> I can't tell if you're for the occult or against it. You stink of stupidity. Don't be mean. Only 30% stupidity. It's 70% ridiculousness. <laughs> I stink of how dare you. Well, you do stink, though. That's fine. <laughs> That's fine? Well, um, no one has taken a shower in five days and he's been in a robot costume? <laughs> yeah. Um, anyway, I hope your prediction turns out to be true. S smelling like a trading card shop in here. <laughs> <laughs> well, at the very least, I won't murder anyone. Yeah. Me either. I mean, I would never. Of course. Me either. Indeed. Well, we know who our victims are. <laughs> Nor I. That goes for me too, of course. I would never kill any of my friends. Not a one you, of you! <laughs> you Kyoko, guys on the other hand. for a second? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I felt like those words of encouragement were helping us come together as one. 
After so much sacrifice- One murder victim! <laughs> After so much sacrifice and hardship, we'd finally become united. But if you just move one letter over, it becomes untied. <gasps> but... <laughs> to be honest, I wish Becca and Toka were here for this too. Oh, right. They're still alive. I forgot. Yeah. I thought these they, were the they're just, they're survivors. Just, yeah, they're just not cool uh, with with the with the togetherness mission. Yeah. But they're so hard to deal with. They only think about themselves. It's like they're like potential murderers or whatever. <laughs> yeah, we bet we're better off without them, I say. That was enough to prove we were united for the first time being. But within that bond hid weakness and fragility. For the time being. I don't know why I added in first. 70% weakness, 30% fragility. <laughs> the alien stole the fragility. Oh. Whoa. Is that All-Star Apologies? Chiro and That's that and yeah, Owie? Chiro and Owie, yeah. Oh, okay. I guess the black hair threw me off. We mm. began our search as soon as we'd finished our breakfast in the dining hall. We had to find out what had opened up. What was waiting for us? It was a can of whoop ass! <laughs> Who could have imagined? <laughs> the butthole! The poop was crowning! Alright, I don't know why. <laughs> That's okay. That's the we're, first we're place we're, I went. We're in that kind of mood. Yeah. I was prairie dogging it! <laughs> uh, no. take a look at the- take a look at the map. Mm -hmm. And we'll- we'll see where our friends are. Well, maybe there's somebody around here. No, okay. Uh, map. That's the wrong map. This map. This map. There's nobody up here. Whoopsie doodles. Nobody up here. How about here? Nobody. What about here? Where the fuck is everyone? Did, did everyone just like vanish? Are they on the new floor that we couldn't get to before? Uh. No. Yeah, you're just going back and map. forth between the first and second floor. Try the third. I don't think I have access to the third. Oh, there it is. Oh, there it is. Physics lab. Nobody's there. Huh, no one's around. What the f- what? But usually it just... It tells well, me- Well, Sakura said- Sakura said new areas have opened up. Oh, okay. Okay, got it. Because of- the, Because we finished areas? a trial. I guess maybe the third floor has the new area? Or not? I don't know. Fast travel, dog. Oh, right. I can just go to the third floor. You've got the gift of teleportation. Okay. God damn it. <laughs> There's so many menus. <laughs> There's like yeah, yeah. that menu and this menu and the other menu. Always look for the plans within plans. Here we go. Fourth floor. Perf. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Okay. New access. floor, baby. So now well, we have access. Nice. Yeah, it's all gold. So now we have access to the fourth floor of Hope's Peak Academy. Maybe this time we'll find some kind of clue. No! This time, I have to find it! <laughs> Back down to the third floor! <laughs> <laughs> I'm dizzy, this place is too high. <laughs> oh, oh, data lab. Ooh. Rattle, rattle. No good, door's locked. I guess I won't be getting in here. According to the nameplate, this is called data center. So obviously nothing of importance. But what's behind the door is a total mystery. Other than the fact that it's a center for data. <laughs> it's fine. Let's go into this door and find out what's in here. It's blue. <gasps> it's your favorite yeah, boy. Yeah, it's our boy. I'm glad this floor got opened up and all, but there's like a ton of locked rooms up here. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's like trying to get into the door to my heart. <laughs> Can never tell what time it is. The clock. What use is time in here? I'm looking for the nicest. Surveillance camera. No. Yeah. Hit me up with those nice coins. Give me a nice. Yes. Nice. nice. Just 143 nice coins. What the fuck? Boy, they really want you to uh, hook people up with presents. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, they really want you to get attached to these people before they die. <laughs> yeah, maybe I should. Uh... Oh, hello, I'm Monokuma from the school store. Score store. I'm very kind. Gather up your coins and come play with me, or you might die of loneliness. Or I might die mm. of loneliness. Oh. Poor guy. I guess I should yeah. help him out. 
He's very kind, according to him. <laughs> Ooh. Kem! Nice. What does that mean? <laughs> oh, sick. Hey. Friends. Inside this room, the smell of medicine was oppressive. So this is the chem lab. I hope inhaling all this stuff doesn't do permanent damage. Let's talk to Owie. <laughs> Hina and Sakura seem to be lost in a deep but friendly conversation. <laughs> oh no, they have permanent damage! <laughs> I need to find out what's going on with Sakura and the mastermind, but I can't while she's with Hina. Huh? You need something? N no, it's nothing. You sure? Okay then. Alright, well that's the end of it. <laughs> Sakura has lost a conversation with Hina. I need to find out what's going on with Sakura and the mastermind, but I can't while she's with Hina. What is it, Makoto? Do you need something? N no, it's nothing. So really? Well, okay. Hmm. Very All suspicious. Right. B! It's a remarkably big shelf, and it's stocked with all kinds of medicine. Ah, right. uh, listen, Makoto, listen! Just take a deep breath and calm down and listen! Right. <laughs> okay, Hina, <laughs> just chill out. There's all kinds of stuff we didn't have before. Vitamins, minerals, amino acids, creatine. Okay. And what? They even have protein zyme X, <laughs> which is definitely real. Mm -hmm. What? What's that? It's made of unobtainium. <laughs> a high quality protein drink. It's nothing like that cheap swill in the warehouse. It's kind of sewer level. Oh, yeah? This is amazing. It's a gold mine. Ah, oh, my prayers have finally been answered. Time to load up some more prayers then. I hope I yeah. don't die. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, start with that one. That's a great <laughs> prayer. A gold mine, huh? Well, all right then. Is it gonna be the same conversation or is it different? Loss of friendly. I guess so. Okay then, bye bye. Bye bye. Leave the area. See ya. Maybe we can give her a present. Okay. <laughs> it's, it's, it's not uh, free time yet. Oh, I see. Oh, Jesus. Oh, what's this oh, over here? They were growing flowers. This is the office. But of course there's no hint of any teachers that we'd normally be able to rely on. There's a picture on the ground. It's a you fool me. Huh, there's a picture on the floor. This picture. Oh, weird. Was that Sayaka? Yeah, that's Sayaka, Celeste, and Hifumi. Oh. Celeste, Hifumi, and Sayaka?! The smiling faces of three people who are dead now. A classroom without metal plates over the windows. This is a bunch of hooey. It's exactly the same. It's just like that picture I saw before. It's so weird. Why does everyone know each other and they're not saying anything? Yeah. No one There's mentioned anything like that. There's no way this isn't important somehow. They're smiling the way you'd expect any normal teenager to smile. Just a normal group of high schoolers living a normal school life. I can't possibly believe they were able to smile like that in a world of despair like this. What if they're all still alive? Oh my god. And they're all in on the plot to kill. I- I still what? posit that this entire thing is, a uh, is a ploy to like train me and I think everyone's in on it um and I'm supposed to be the ultimate detective or some shit oh man I that's, don't know there's so many ways you could go with this that's my theory so does that mean this picture was taken before they ever came to Hope's Peak which would mean everyone in the picture knew each other before they got here including Sayaka international pop star <laughs> Every time he says Sayaka, he starts like crying. He's like, even Sayaka. <laughs> no, there's no way. I see way. her everywhere. There, there's six pictures of Sayaka up on the wall, dressed as old Japanese men. <laughs> oh, Sayaka, I miss you. So I miss you. <laughs> no, there's no way. Monokuma did it. It must be fake. No, you are fake. Monokuma popped out of nowhere and snatched the picture from my hand. The forgery plot. What are you, a middle schooler? You think the moon landing was fake too? Come on! Well, then actually, the Van Allen radiation belts, there's no way that they could have gotten through that and survived to get to the moon. 
And yeah. Then, Haven't you seen this, you, uh, the big C on a rock? <laughs> yeah. Unless you read a science article, in which case you find out that that's total horseshit and <laughs> it's no problem to pass through that radiation belt. All right, well, whatever. Yeah, they look weird jumping around. It was obviously slowed down footage. <laughs> <laughs> then you're saying this picture is real? Um, if there were such a thing as a Nobel Truth Prize, I'd take first, second, and fourth place! Actually, that's probably not true. I- I asked you a question! Is this picture real or is it a fake? Oh, Makoto, you're so eager to split things in half, aren't you? Hey, um, but it's yeah, no I use. guess I am a half bear. <laughs> <laughs> it's just no use! It's no use! If you try to split something you can't be split, you'll end up feeling like you're the one being split. The picture is real. The picture is real. No more, no less. <laughs> Without another word, Monokuma disappeared. So Man. the picture is real? Yeah. It's really real? <laughs> Great job. If that's Makoto. true, he's a, he's a detective, if ever there was one. <laughs> if that's the case... Uh, <laughs> if that's the case, what? <laughs> yeah. Is it real or is it fake? It's real. So you're saying it's real? <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let me flash back to two seconds ago when you said it was real. <laughs> oh my god. There's a flower on the desk. Somehow it makes things feel that much weirder. The, you know, there was a person who was my special flower site. <laughs> There's a flower on the desk. Oh, oh, well, another nice, one. Nice, nice. Maybe I'll look at this flower. Get another nice. There's a flower on the desk. Nice! Nice! <laughs> oh, what about this one? Hold on. There's Is it on the desk? on the desk? Is it a flower? Oh. Nice! <laughs> oh. One more. There's a flower on the desk. De desk flower nice. weird! Nice! <laughs> okay, great. Oh, that's sick. And then the TV. This is one of them monitors Monokuma appears. This is one of them monitors that Monokuma appears on. Being scared of it won't do it any good. I'm better off just ignoring it completely. No nice. Boo! <laughs> no nice November over here. <laughs> uh, Alright. Where did I come from? Where did I go? Where did I come from? Would you like to figure it out? Next time on Game Grumps, the headmaster's office. Holy crap. N -T -O -G -G. That seems important. Yeah, all right. Next time on Game Grumps, we'll go to the headmaster's office. Hell yeah. Unless this door is locked, in which case that'll be a that'll be a big old letdown. Yeah, that'll be a big old letdown. <laughs> cool. Later. Bye everyone. I'm gonna pee get more water. Do it, do it, do it.